when you uh, are in grade school and when you are in high school, um, there is this feeling that the friends that you have there are going to be your BFFs for life. And that means that uh, sometimes those friends that sometimes talk you into doing um, things that pro you probably shouldn't be doing, um, you know, those are the friends that are going to keep you off, off track. But what you come to realize as you get older is those aren't going to be your friends for life. And so that one thing that you did at that moment in time could have an impact uh, for the rest of your life. Um, as you get older, I think that you begin to realize that there are some friends that are temporary friends that help you get through a moment. There are friends who um, are you might have some friends from grade school and high school, and that's always great when you're when you're able to have that one or two, you know, really good friends. But you know, especially nowadays with with Facebook and with all of these different tools, we want to call everybody friends, um, and we want to we want to think that everybody really thinks about us in a very special way. But as you're trying to achieve your own personal and professional goals, and you start feeling that people around you are holding you back or you know, inviting you to that uh, party, that wild party on a Friday or Saturday night where you really need to focus on that important exam that you need to take in order to get you into law school or in order to get you into uh, college, then they're not a good friend. They're not, they're not thinking about you. They're not watching out for your, for your best interests. And so um, this is true for, for young women, but this is also true for you as you become an adult. Um, I think that um, you'll start realizing that, that your circles will become smaller, but your friendships will become stronger.